Hey there, Stephen Peck from Loves to Travel. Um, kind of late in coming, but I wanted to show you our uh, some pictures anyway and some video from Diamond Head State Monument on uh, on uh, Honolulu on Oahu. We did not take any video climbing. However, we did take a lot of pictures, and we did get video from the top of Diamond Head, didn't we? Yes, we did. Uh, before we get to Diamond Head, I just want to let you know there are certain park hours you are allowed to go in. Mm -hmm. They are from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Right. Last entry is 4 p.m. Right. And you must enter the trail by 4.30. That means they expect you an hour and a half to go up and down. And it does take a good hour and a half to climb it. Also, I want to uh, mention that if you're an out-of-state or out of uh, yeah, out-of-state resident, then you need to make a reservation. If you're an in-state resident, no reservations are needed. But if you're not a state resident, you need to make a reservation to, to go into a Diamond Head. Right, and there is actually a fee. Entry is $5 and parking is $10 for a car. Mm -hmm. So you can fit as many people in the car. But you are supposed to reserve up to 30 days in advance we reserved it the day before and didn't get the best time. You really want to climb Diamond Head in the early morning before yep. it gets a little too warm. Yep. However, we did make the climb. We did make it all the way to the top. Um, and there is some video from the very, very top of Diamond Head. But we want to show you some pictures and then we'll show you the video too. So one thing that we also need to mention that parking and entry fees, they must be purchased online through this website about Diamond Head State Monument Reservation. So make sure you do that ahead of time before you go. And so the history about Diamond Head it is a crater. Volcanic crater, yes. And then according to this, there is 731 feet high. Mm -hmm. And then and we managed to get every one of them. Yeah, and uh, what you said, there was a lot of switchbacks and yep. stuff like that. Makes it easy, easier to climb with switchbacks going up. Instead of going straight up, you got switchbacks. Brown, it's that bad all the way up. But as I was, as most people should do is... Take a break. Yeah, it, they will be benches throughout. Drink so. water. Yeah. Make sure you stop and admire the scenery as you're going up because it's absolutely gorgeous. Take a couple of breaks uh, as you're going up because it is rough to get up there. Of course, we had to stop and take some pictures. Mm -hmm. And you do go through some caves. Mm -hmm. And this is probably the toughest climb here where you say you are here. Technically, you're supposed to go around. Yeah, it says it's easier going left when you get to this point, going left and around and up rather than going up all the stairs at one time. There's 99 stairs going straight up, or you can go looping around and going up. We did the 99 stairs straight up. So why do we do the 99 stairs, honey? I don't know. Somebody picked the 90, oh, you wanted to stay out of the sun, that's right. why. Right, that's the reason why, and here we are climbing the stairs. 99 steps, you gotta climb. And Steve did struggle a little bit, but he did fine. I got three quarters of the way up and I had to take a breather for half a second, and then I made it powered the rest of the way up. Honey, you can do it. You're almost there. I know. Take your time. I just let those people get by, that's all. I almost got it. I know. I was letting those people go by. I guess it's called a lookout, but it's also called a pillbox, I think. I'm not sure, but it's it's the lookout uh, where the soldiers used to look out during World War II to uh, keep an eye on anything coming in. Uh, this is one of them. There's like three of them, maybe even four of them, uh, at least in this location anyway. Again, looking out of the pillbox in different directions. Now here's some video going around. We're at the very, very top of Diamond Head, the very, very top of the uh, of the uh, military installation at the top of Diamond Head. And I did a kind of a 360 video around so you can see just how high we are. I didn't really talk during this. I just wanted to show you how high we are and how beautiful it looks. And apparently you can't go to Hawaii without seeing a rooster somewhere. And of course, when we were done, we did hit a famous bakeries. Oh gosh, the 
donuts were so good at Leonard's Bakery. If, if you go to Leonard's, if you go to Hawaii, if you go to Oahu, go to Leonard's Bakery. These donuts are so good. And it was actually great because after we climbed, we each had a couple. Mm -hmm. Just to get our sugar back. Thanks for watching this. Appreciate you hanging out with us, watching this. Here's a few more pictures uh, from the top of Diamond Head uh, and a couple of other things. Uh, again, thanks for watching. Have a magical day.